I started investing in 1975 and, and I've heard this ever since and, and historically before it. This time is different. Uh, you know, all those great market returns were, were a golden time. The market from 1975 when I started investing until now has grown on an average, I think, of 12%. Now, I'm not predicting it's going to continue to do that. People say, well, that's a golden age, you can't repeat it. That might be true. I would be more conservative in my projections looking forward, but I will say this. In 1975 to now was no smooth ride. We had stagflation in the 1970s. We have, we've been bogged down in multiple foreign wars. We've gone off the gold standard. Uh, we've had, in 1987, the single worst uh, percentage decline in the market in a day. We had the huge collapse uh, in 07, 08. We had the tech market collapse in 99 and several things that I'm probably not remembering. This was not some smooth golden period. And yet, while the market was very volatile, at the end of the day, on average, it went up 12% a year. That's extraordinary. That's extraordinary. So do we need a golden period for the next 40 years to see great returns? No. Now that's good news because we're probably not going to have a golden period because there have been no golden periods. If you go back 100 years and the market has relentlessly gone up, you know, you're looking at depressions and, and world wars and does the market respond to those things and go down as it fell? Absolutely. But then it turns around and it keeps going up. And that's why I say with a fair amount of confidence that short of the country ending, short of civilization ending, are bad things going to happen? Absolutely. Is that going to make the market volatile and scary? Absolutely. Is the market going to recover and continue to go up and be higher 20, 30, 40 years from now? Absolutely. Thank you.